Okay, right, hello everyone. The reason why I groan like that is because it took me so long to get this bloody thing started. To turn on my computer, computer wants to go slow, decided to clear out some stuff to, I don't know, make it go fast. Either way, I've done it, made it better. Now we're here. Uh, hi, how's everyone's new year going? Uh, mine's going great so far. So, I thought, why not start with uh, the continuation of Downfall, eh? So, last time we left off, we have a severed human head that I think we're going to cook. And there's the plant. <laughs> and now we get the severed human head. Use. This is madness. I would only ever consider this if I really had no other choice. Uh, blender. Um, switch on. No point in switch. It's empty. Oh, yeah, that, that's why I'm going to put stuff in in the bloody blender. Fuck it. Come on! Right. Head. Use. Oh my, come on! Switch on. No point. But, uh, I don't, I don't get it. Right, hang on. Quick apart. Turn on the hob. There's nothing good. Oh, hang on, hang on. <laughs> hang on, recipe. What's this? Uh, my, my fattening smoothie recipe, deep fried belly fat, one pint of castor oil, glass of spirit, one human head. And he's got the human head. And, oh my god, no, one leaf. Blend it together and enjoy. Okay. I think we got that. So, you're cooking us dinner now? No. It's not for us. Oh, good. Good. Because they're not really meant to fry things in castor oil, you know. No. <laughs> I think I'll try anyway. <laughs> uh, bud, use. Not here. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> um, gin, use. Not here. For God's sake! Turn the knob. And then we put. The human head in. Fuck! Ah! It's boiling hot. Cool, great. Let me just. I don't know. Oh no! Wrong one. Wrong one. I don't care. Right. Uh, recipe. What's the recipe? Wait, my friend is deep. So deep fried belly flat. I don't have one pint of castor oil. That's done that. Glass of spirit. I thought I had the spirit, which is the gin. Use? Not here? Oh, oh I find if you don't want to do it, don't do it. Do I need to get a pig fat or something? Smeg. <laughs> Red Wolf reference. Um. Hmm. Switch on. Yeah. Okay, I think I'm in a bit of a pickle. Oh, I, I do have the fan being an idiot. I enter there. Do 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 There we go. Right. Fat. Fat 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 fat. And then uh gin. Not here. Okay. Um Take the deep fried fat. So hot. I could just stick my hand. I can't just Hey, I found this fork in the house with all the coffins. You might want to use it for whatever you're doing there. Oh, thanks, Agnes. <laughs> Yay. Thanks. You're welcome. Right, so... Um, oh, we can't turn it off now. Now, can you put the smoothie in? Uh... Deep fried fat. Use. <laughs> this is going to be funny. Head. What are you doing there, Joe? Nothing. <laughs> oh, another. <laughs> you don't want to know. Is that is that a human head? I mean, if you don't like it, don't look. But you can't. Watch me. 
<laughs> you keep for fuck. I mean, it's a it's a fucking it's a human head. What else can you do with it? Uh, gin. And then uh, use this. There we go. And then uh, what else? Okay, so the deep fried attack's fine. Oh, the pint of oh, oh yeah, oil. That's sort of thing. Uh, oil. There we go. And then, uh, switch it on. Mmm! Yummy smoothie! <laughs> So lean. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry for freaking out like that, but that grinding noise—it <laughs> was too much. Uh, it's uh, this up the show. We got, I know, but remember, we're doing this fine. I guess the first one. <laughs> Pull yourself together. We've we've seen worse things here. This is our best shot. We got him. Yeah, I know. But remember, we're doing this for Ivy. Yeah, I know. She'd better be worth it. She got that Come right. On then. Yes. And don't forget to take your smoothie. <laughs> oh yes, my smoothie. Well, that was um an experience. That was <laughs> to censor out the uh the grinding. Let's uh put some rock music on there. Blender, take the smoothie. And then I'm assuming. We give it to the girl on the fourth floor. Hey! How's it going, buddy? Would you like... Oh, oh she's not there. She's not here. Maybe she got spooked by the explosion in the bathroom. No. Not spooked. Did you notice that Harrison's body went missing from the home? Oh, I didn't check. I bet it's got something to do with her. <laughs> you think she took it? But where? Um, her room? Hmm, maybe. Actually, no, hang but on. But we don't really know which room that is. No, Harrison's, There's um... There's some other place we could try for. Harrison's key. Oh, Harrison's room. Harrison's room? The one on the second floor? There's only one way to find out. Let's go. Hooray! Let's go! And see what she's doing! <laughs> Oh, Ivy! Hey! Hey! Hello, Ivy! You're alive! Yay! We did it! Or not! <laughs> I, that was a, a thing. What's wrong with you? You look like you've seen a ghost. That's because I have. Come on. You're not the kind of guy who gets scared of ghosts. No. But that was... different. It was Ivy. Right there. <laughs> well, that was interesting. I can't see anything. She was there. I know what I saw. You really love your Ivy, don't you? 
she wanted me to let her go. But I just couldn't do it. No matter what, I could never stop loving her. The thing with us women is that sometimes we say one thing and mean exactly the opposite. Did you ever notice? Well, yeah, I guess. I wasn't there, so I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure she didn't want you to go. Then I was right for once. Ha! I'd give you a medal if I had one, but I don't, so how about a fist bump? Sure. Not, not really a fist bump, it, it was kind of just... Uh. <laughs> High five! Fist bump, bro! Eh. <laughs> I... I think... I... Uh, oh yes, it was! Oh, it's you! Hello! Hello! <laughs> come in, come in! Oh, aren't you going to say hello, darling? <laughs> that visitors. Oh, yes, he is quite definitely saying hello. You must forgive Harrison. He's feeling a bit poorly today. You think? <laughs> Sophie... This man is dead. Dead? <laughs> what do you mean? I mean... Well, it's just a legless carcass, can't you see? I mean, not alive. Dead as a door now. Gone. Dead tired. Yep, he looks exhausted. Um... Oh god, I suppose... What do I do? I... I'm... It's honest? Well, it's just a legless carcass. Can't you see? Oh, sure, he's a little hurt. Something <laughs> a little bit of TLC won't cure, right? I we had a good talk, and he's promised to change his ways. Oh, but has he? He will never walk away from me again. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure, mate. I'm sure he won't. Um, I've got something for you. Oh, how nice! What is it? I found this recipe for a smoothie. My secret recipe! Oh, I couldn't remember where I'd left it. What, the one with the well, head? I've got it, and I made it for you. Sweet. It's been one crazy day. I'm ravenous. Oh, I'm sure you are. I, I should be on a diet, but... I can start from tomorrow, right? Just don't tell Harrison. Oh yeah, I'm sure he won't notice. Uh... Uh, oh god, this is gonna be difficult. Uh, before we do that, just. Uh, yeah, have the. Have the smoothie. Oh, this is gonna be. This is gonna be bad. Mm, Wait, did that just disappear? So it just smoke. Good. Are you feeling alright? Yes. Wait, I. Oh. Left a funny aftertaste in my mouth. I uh, did it. Do you have to work? Hello. Oh, I, I. Oh. Oof. My stomach. Oh God! Here we go. I feel sick and bloated. Uh huh. What's happening to me? <laughs> Jesus! Oh. What have we done, Joe? I, I, I just didn't need to do. We did what we had to do. I mean, yeah, pretty much. Nice. I, th I think, uh, if I can remember, we've, uh, if I can remember, so there was the one where you had to give the medicine to, there was the fat one, then there was this one, uh, but what, what's the fourth one? It's probably that receptionist lady from the start. Alright, that's done, so, oh, there she is, speak of the devil! Hello. Joe, do you realize how hard it is to wash blood off these carpets? I'm, I mean, not easy, I We just I can't carry on like this. It's time for a serious talk. I'm headed back to my office upstairs. Please come and see me. I have a 
proposition for you. What if I'm not interested? You will be. Trust me. I'll put it all together, the sassy Joe, walk. whatever she's got to say, do not trust this woman. Yeah? I just feel it. She's not a real I mean, person. I mean, I wasn't really trusting her in the first place, so... <laughs> I've, uh, I've got no objections whatsoever. Hmm. Manager's office. There we go. Okay. This is where I want me to, I suppose. Hello. How's it go? What kind of art is that? And here's my American boy. I knew you'd come. But I didn't nice, think um, you'd bring a hanging. chaperone with you. I should kill you right here for what you've done to us. You should have warned us. You should have told us to leave. You should have warned us. You should have told us to leave. But Joe, I'm running a business here. I can't just tell my guests to leave, can I? Now, that would be so rude. I like it. I should kill you right here, right now, for all you've done to us. What's stopping you, Joe? I'm not a murderer. I lost my guilt. I want to find out. Now what you know first. Don't push me. I want to find out what you know first. That's not going to happen. Unless... Well, that's just rude. Unless you strip me naked. Excuse me? Tie me to a bed. And torture me until I scream it out to you. Uh, nah, I'm good. You know I won't do that. No? Shame. <laughs> ah, shame. Um... It's time you told me who you really are. It's time you've told me who you really are. You know very well who I am. I... I am your secret little desire, Joe. Oh. Your perfect woman. Huh. I'm never bitter, or tired, or not in the mood. Instead, I'm composed, and strong, and spontaneous. That's I don't me. burden you with my baggage of problems. I don't poison your life. I don't hide from you. Now is the perfect time for us to reconcile. Is it really? To forget about that little bitch I... Oh, no, 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 no. To run away and be happy. Oh, no, you don't talk smack about my what wife. What do you say, Joe? No. No. I'm not that kind of person. I don't well, need my wife. you're a good guy. After all, you did listen to your wife when she wanted to share her problems. Exactly. And you were always there for her. Exactly. But no one is perfect, Joe. And what's the point? Sometimes even when we think we're right, we're so wrong. Maybe. You know what? I helped you once before, when I left that key on the desk. I'll help you again. Really? Just to prove that I'm not as evil as you seem to think. I very... But that... let's play a little game first. Huh? I want you to follow me to a special place. If it's to a bondage... We're not following you anywhere. If it's to a bondage right, room, I'm, I'm good. The little mouse can talk. Hmm. You have a strange taste in women, Joe. Excuse me? I've got something you need. A perfect weapon. What? Just follow the trail. I'll be waiting. What trail? We're not gonna do it, are we? I know you don't trust her, but we might have no choice. A perfect weapon. Tempting. Well, that was lovely. Remind me to never do that again. Okay, what do we got? Um, I suppose a noose, but uh, can't really do that at the moment, I suppose. Oh, hang on. Oh, I, I've only just noticed the... <laughs> I, I can't believe I was so stupid. I just noticed the hanging there. <laughs> oh, God, that's just lovely. Weapon is to kill it, so... It's a shoe. I, I, I guess we're going in here then. Oh, shut. So much for following the trail, but this door leads to the staircase. She's probably gone down the stairs. Okie dokie. Okay, so. Ah, blouse. She went this way. Okay. Stocking. Black stocking. Clean shoes. Left something here. What she got on the end of the kitchen? Uh, oh. 
Okay. Oh, this is surprising. Smeg opens a door. Open fridge. Uh, I guess walk inside. Let's see where this goes, eh? Oh, that is that panties? Yep, that's panties. White panties. She must have getting closer. So I tell you, most of our clothes off. Oh God, do I have to censor? <laughs> <laughs> I got the achievement perv. Well done to me. Oh, God. Hello? <laughs> and uh, that's a bra. I'm probably going to need to censor. Come on. Agnes. Just a second. I think I saw something. Did you? I... I don't leave me alone! Turns out it was nothing. Hey, wait for me! <laughs> Joe! Let me in! Ah, sh Oh, shit! Ah, crap. What's that whispering? Oh, um, hi, Ivy. Wait, hang on! It's Agnes Ivy. Hmm. Only darkness this way. Okay. Hmm. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. This is where we... Oh. What? Uh, I, uh, I, uh, but, uh, oh, uh, oh. Agnes! Oh, this should be interesting. What took you so long, handsome? Excuse me? Okay, yep, I'm censoring that. <laughs> Welcome to my private bedroom, Joe. Come closer. Don't be shy. Would you just explain all this? Why won't you just explain all of this to me? What's there to explain? Isn't it obvious that we fancy each other? I don't I'm fancy you. I'm pretty sure our hands are supposed no. to bend that way, but all right. Then tell me this. Actually, no, 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 no. On your way here, when you found my panties, did you examine them? Uh, I'm gonna say no. No. Liar. You couldn't resist, and that's okay. I wanted you to do it. But really, I just want to understand what's going on here. Oh, but didn't we already have this conversation? I what? mean, I, not in a way. I want to know why you're seeing naked. Well, I still didn't get any answers. But every time you tell me, do yeah. But every time we do, you tell me exactly nothing. Fine. I'll tell you a secret. Okay. Okay. This hotel is built on an ancient Indian burial ground. Wha what? <laughs> You'd believe anything at this point, wouldn't you? I mean, if it explains the madness, Except the then, truth, yeah. of course. That one is always hard to accept. Well, I want the truth, please. I've seen this axe before. This axe? Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. But it's just an ordinary fire axe. We keep it here in case of, you know, fire. There's blood on it. <sighs> Maybe just a drop or two? I don't think... What is it doing here? It's, it's a gift for you. I told you. This ox will be your final weapon. Oh. You're expecting me to murder somebody with this axe? Oh, don't play innocent, Joe. You've already murdered a bunch of people today. I mean, and some animals. They were not real people. Look. I'm not saying it bothers me. 
All I want is for us to be together. But that's not going to happen unless you take this axe and remove that one last obstacle. And what is that? Ivy? Go to hell, woman. Not Ivy. I know you wouldn't do that. The creature standing right behind you. Oh. Oh! You didn't mistake her for a friend by any chance, did you? That sweet, naive little Agnes. Her only purpose was to stop you in your tracks. She was lying to you all along. Just look at her. This is the real Agnes. Nah. The parasite that you have to kill. Nah. No. That's a lie. I don't believe you. It's your choice. But deep down, you know what you've got to do. Yeah, I'm gonna kill you. Grab that ox. Take a big swing. And fuck her up. But excuse you. Right, take the axe. And then... You can do it, Joe. You really think I'll fall for these lies? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Yeah, baby! Ha <laughs> ha! Get wrecked, scrub! <laughs> Get wrecked! Right. Sophie, I'm coming for you. This is the end. Okay, things are really now piping up. Might even just make this one just extra long. Okay, time to kill that hideous abomination. I only hope I'm doing the right thing. Door. I bet she came through here. Great, she locked the door behind her, but that's not gonna stop me. Uh, break, I suppose. <laughs> I know this music. Oh, hang on a minute. Oh, this is going to be fun. Weird trip again, it seems. Okay. I'm back home. Oh, okay. It's addressed to me. Looks like I don't need the axe anymore. Let's just put down the axe for a minute and just think about what we're doing. <laughs> what is it? A chainsaw! What the f- Mike quite hate 
but what did I just pick up? Hey, it's the cat lady. <laughs> they call me all sorts of names. If I play the piano after dark for two minutes. But no one does anything when there's real bloody noise in the middle of the night. <sighs> How's it going? It seems to be coming from Joe's flat. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no. Uh, oh, this is bad. The fireworks is missing. Oh, God, this is going to be fun. Thanks, interesting. Uh, okay. Is it the door's wide open? Uh. Hello. Hello. Uh oh. Oh no! This is gonna be bad. Hi, big fat woman. End of the road, bitch. Just ask the cat. Kill. Yay! Copyrighted. Okie dokie. I'm just going to save the game. Save icon. Oh, uh, what? Um, um, final question mark? Okay, let's enter through here. I suppose we don't have Agnes anymore. That's uh, that's a, that's just sad. I really liked her. No, right, let's see what's going on. Hey, it's an Ivy. I recognise her boots. Do it. Dead. Ah! All of this. For nothing. Ah! Except. Bugger. I will never give up on you. Never. There's still a way to bring you back. Is there? Oh! Yes! There is, actually! This, it's gonna be weird, but. It, come. it could work. Oh! I guess we're playing the cat lady again. Please, just don't start ringing all of a sudden. What the heck? This hole leads right into the Morrison's old flat. Too high to jump. What's been going on here? It's chained to the floor. Very odd. Neil. It looks like flies having a great time on the same plate of rotten food. Wait, hang on. Have we been just been in a, having an entire psychotic episode? Or maybe there's different endings to this and I'm just... Oh! 
open lock. I have a lock on the bedroom. Maybe there's multiple endings to this and I just happen to get the bad ending like I do. That uh, achievement on the second floor works. How can we not? Uh, I suppose not. Oh, yeah, because there's an elevator here. Okay. Oh, the, oh there's only the fifth floor. Oh, okay. Uh. Shit. Right. If I can. That's the ground floor, that's the first floor. That's the second floor. So we're back to here. Uh, okay. Use the boat then, I suppose. I'll tie it to the chair. It should easily hold my weight. Hopefully. Oh, I... Okay, um, this is different. What the? Where do you think you're going? Who? Uh, who's that? What you got there, son? Another dead body to add to the list? Mm -hmm. Dad? You know... What's dad? Hello. Your mother always loved Robbie more. He was such a happy kid. Always smiling. And you. You let him fucking die. It was an accident, and you know it. You were supposed to watch him. Was it so hard to take care of your younger brother for five fucking minutes? That's referring to the beginning of the game. He didn't want to listen. Well, it doesn't even matter anymore. My life ended the moment. Your mother. What? You remember. You were there too. When what? You didn't even cry. Goodbye, Dad. I'll finish my cigarette and I'll go. There's nothing left for me here. You're a grown man. This home is yours now. Enjoy. Okay. So his dad murdered his mom. That's lovely. Oh, yeah, it's, it's all right up in the bed to the left. Uh, okay. What the fuck? Ah, I see you have taken matters into your own hands, young man. How are you still alive? <laughs> I thought you were dead. I do appreciate a good initiative, but I'm afraid it's not going to work. I thought you were dead. No, no. Death is but a state of mind. And my mind has always been a wandering one. What do you want? I felt inclined to inform you that what you are trying to achieve here is, well, pointless. Why? It worked before. I brought Agnes back. This whole idea was flawed from the start. There simply isn't enough power here to alter the subject's state of mind. No one has that kind of power. I like to defy the odds. Well, except the subject herself, perhaps. But as you see, sadly, she is not willing to cooperate. 
Nothing is impossible. Nothing is impossible. You are a stubborn one. So fine, go and see for yourself. Do it. I, Just do it. Yes, in fact, I will. Just... <laughs> for God's sake. This bloody game and its references. Okay. Uh, easy monitor, examine. Uh, generator. This is going to take so much electricity. Yep. Uh, lever. Pull. Let's do it. Did I just accidentally fire to a crisp? Oh! Someone's screaming. Great. What the heck is this? Can only mean one thing. Huh. Joe's lost the plot. I always knew there was something wrong with him. Just stay calm, Susan. You can deal with this. After all, you are one immortal. Step at a time. I've been there before. It always starts with a weapon. Music take. There's something shiny stuck inside the pipe, but there's <gasps> hidden water. Yep, that's fine. Uh, I suppose use the boomstick. I can't quite catch it with this. I need something more pointy. Okay. Uh, what else is there? Quiet Haven Hotel. <laughs> so. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Okay. Now, now you got me. After all this time, was it really just a big psychotic episode that we just had, and we're trying to justify? Murdering Ivy. Um, what, what is this? All these. Ah. Uh, crafting table. Crafting. Uh, I could build a weapon here. Oh, we got the broomstick, I suppose. Uh, but tell you. Uh, I can, let's go on for a little bit longer, see if I can, I don't know, go a bit further. So, look inside. Is this, oh god, these are the charred remains of a cat inside! Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> uh, can we add the skull of the cat? Oh my bloody god, we can. Okay. This is very weird to play as, you know, Susan the Catwoman. Okay, someone's been a lock. Tell you what, though. Um, I think I've been recording for long enough, and I thought I was gonna reach the end, but I think we are pretty close at this point now, so... Uh, probably tomorrow's video is gonna be short, but... <laughs> That's pretty funny. But either way, I think we're at the... Well, pretty much at the final point of the of the uh, series now. Um, but I'd like to thank you very much for joining me. Um, next episode is probably going to be the final part of Downfall. And uh, when that time comes, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, why don't you like, comment, favorite, and subscribe to see more content like this. And I'll see you all in the next video. You take care now.